Hey everybody, Plushy here, and finally, uh, the results of the rerun poll that was held a long time ago earlier this year has been announced, and the two events that won out are the Summer 6 event as well as the FGO Arcade collab, uh, Lilim Harlot, or the Draco event. So yeah, we will be getting both of these rerun events back to back, in fact. The Summer 6 rerun will start right after the Mahoyo collab event ends this Friday on May 17th, all the way until June 7th. And the Lilum Harlot rerun will follow up right after the uh, Summer 6 rerun from June 7th all the way up to June 28th. So that's pretty cool. Um, even though we're not getting any new events, we are getting back to back rerun events, which is something we haven't gotten in a long while. And on top of just rerunning these two events, they will be hosting numerous celebration campaigns for these rerun events, and you will be getting a total of 30 Saint Courts and 4 tickets across the months of May and June. Uh, they really like to hype things up by telling you how many total courts you'll be getting <laughs> across two months, which, I mean, it's still pretty cool, you know, it's free stuff, but uh, it's not that impressive as it looks. Uh, but most importantly, at least uh, as of now, we did get get the basic information for the rerun version of Summer 6, and they will be adding a 90 plus plus node uh, to this event. And if you don't remember, uh, Summer 6 is the event that allows you to farm for treasure chests, and these treasure chests will drop uh, during all of the farming free quests, and they will open up and contain great materials, as you can see here in this graphic. So this is one of the best infinite farming events that isn't a lotto. Um, and now that they they're adding a 90 plus plus node to it means that they will have even better drops than before. Uh, so prepare your event CEs from Summer 6 if you haven't burnt them already. Uh, and, you know, definitely don't burn them now uh, and get ready for some more farming. And of course, coming with the rerun event also comes the rerun of the really versatile uh, welfare ruler Da Vinci, who ever since her debut has had two, in my opinion, major extra synergy pieces. Uh, one, because she can boost overcharge, so she works pretty well with Tonalico in multi-core farming. And then two, she has a targetable rainbow buff, so she can work with Yui Shosetsu and give a servant uh, full access to Yui's entire MP effect. So uh, she's a pretty nice servant to have, and if you already have her, I do suggest keeping a lower level copy for esports purposes and whatnot, uh, so pretty nice to have. Uh, and of course, the event also comes with one of the best uh, welfare CEs we've ever gotten in FGO, which is Ocean Flyer, uh, still one of the most staple arts farming CEs in the game right now, uh, so make sure to grab at least one MLB copy of that. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this super short news video. I'm obviously milking content off of this because I haven't really been posting a lot of spoken content recently, but my super long alcohol hot take is in the process of being edited already. It is 42 minutes long, so I apologize for how long it's taking. Um, but yeah, look forward to that as well, I guess. Shameless plug. Anyways, see you guys in the next one.